the city is covered in snow. Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here, my name is Brianna and in today's video, we are going to talk about some things that every nurse needs for Christmas. So if you are confused or wondering what to get the nurse in your life for Christmas, you are in the right spot. I am here to help you out. When you're thinking of a gift to give the nurse in your life, there are three things that you should be considering. Does it involve comfort? Does it involve caffeine? And does it involve helping us to not look like a zombie? If you can find things that fit into those three categories, you will be golden. So I have some things here with me today that I wanted to share with you that I thought would be fantastic ideas of things to get the nurse in your life for Christmas. So the first thing that I have on my list are these adorable little hair ties that I found at Nordstrom. These are by a company called Slip and they are known for not tearing your hair. They are little scrunchies, little ponytail holders. Let me just take these out made out of silk. This company also makes little pillowcases and eye covers, but this is what they look like. I've been wearing the little leopard print one that came in this for a few days now, and I do love it. So the reason that I think that this is a fantastic gift for the nurse in your life is because as nurses, we are always having to keep our hair up in some way to keep it out of the way. I mean, you cannot be in a bloody situation with all of this nastiness going everywhere and your hair hanging in it. It has to be up, out of our way. We have things to do and this cannot be down at work. It just can't. It's hot, we're moving around, it's in the way. Long story short, we have to wear our hair up all the time. And I don't know about other nurses, but myself, I find that regular ponytail holders, after wearing them days and days in a row, they seem to break my hair off. And then I get these little bitty short hairs that just kind of like stick out everywhere when I put my hair up in a ponytail. And they look ridiculous because it's hair that has been broken off. And it makes your head sore, you get a headache by the end of the day, your scalp literally feels like it's bruised from having your hair in a ponytail or in a bun 24 seven, hashtag nurse life. So I have been trying out these ponytail holders for the past week at work and I absolutely love them. I do notice that I have less hair come out onto my ponytail holder when I take my hair down and I have less hair breakage. I also have less headaches. Like there's something about this hair tie that keeps all of this hair up in a ponytail or up in a bun without feeling like my head is being squeezed off by the end of the day. So these little guys at Nordstrom were like $25 for a pack of four. They make the most cute little stocking stuffer or even um, a little Christmas tree ornament with the packaging that it comes in. I would highly recommend these for the nurse in your life. She will absolutely love them. Now, number two the loopy case. I absolutely love loopy cases. I started using these a couple of years ago and I'm telling you, I cannot go back. There is something about these cases that make my phone so comfortable in my hands. So this one was one from my old phone. This is the first loopy case that I got. And what makes them unique is that they have this little rubber loop that this is how it looks on the inside of the case. It just kind of, you can take these out and change the little loops. Ugh, let me get it out. Okay. So you can, these are interchangeable, the little loops. They are so cute. I also have this little leopard print one that I really love. And oh, I've got one on my phone right now that matches my pajamas. Here it is. It is so cute. So this fits in my hand so perfectly. Sometimes when I am on the floor, I have to talk to the doctor. I need to tell him something immediately. And I don't want to interrupt him while he's in the middle of like an exam or he's in the middle of dealing with a patient or a code situation at the hospital. So it's so much easier for me to communicate via text. So um, when I am communicating via text, I need to do this quickly. 
I don't have time to mess around. I don't have time to send big long things. Um, I just need to whip my phone out, say what I need to say, get it done. So this little guy right here keeps me from dropping my phone. I can just pull it out of my pocket, say what I need to say, and then put it back in. I don't have to worry about fumbling around with my phone. It just stays so secure in my hand. I absolutely love these cases. Highly recommend them. They range between $35 and $45. And as always, I will put a link to these cases below in the description box. I absolutely love them. And I've even gotten my husband addicted to them. I've tried those pop socket things that go on the back of your cases. First of all, they never stick on the cases that I want. Um, they always end up coming off, like every single one that I've had. So the loopy thing is cute. And like I said, you can buy different little loops for them. So they have little Christmas print ones, they have different you know, holiday prints, they have different colors, they have glow in the dark ones, you can change out the little loops. Um, so anyway, love the loopy cases. Also, nurses, we do a lot of charting. I mean, I don't care what kind of healthcare system you work for, what part of healthcare you're in, you are going to be required to document the very same thing in at least five different places. Yeah, I don't know who designs this or who decides where we have to document things in, but there is a lot of redundant documentation. So we spend so much time at the computer screen and so much time that we don't actually have, might I add. So while we are at the computer screen for so long, for myself, for example, when I am entering monthly medication reviews on my patients, monthly foot checks on my patients, monthly care plans, these things take so much time at the computer screen. And so when I do finally get a chance to sit down and do them, I'm there for a while and I get such an awful headache. So I've come up with a solution and they are these adorable little blue light blocking glasses. Aren't they cute? I ordered a package of four off of Amazon for like $16. I mean, you can't beat that. I got this cute little tortoise color and just a regular black frame because the girl's gotta match her scrubs, you know? And then I thought this little pink color was cute. And also these clear frames because these seem to be like all the rage right now. Everybody is buying clear frames. I don't know that I necessarily like how I look in my glasses. I wear contacts pretty much all the time because glasses are very uncomfortable for me. I can never get them adjusted correctly on my face where they don't give me a headache. But when I am doing massive amounts of charting, I would like to keep these bad boys by the computer at work or in my bag so that I am not getting a headache. They are blocking the blue light that is coming from the screen that causes me to have headaches from having to sit there and eternally chart. The next gift that I found is actually probably my favorite. This is a coffee mug and not just any coffee mug, but the coffee mug of all coffee mugs. This is by a company called Kopi. Let me just show you what this cute little coffee mug looks like. It comes in different colors. I just kind of got this little muted green color, mint green maybe, if you want to call it that. What makes this coffee cup special, you ask? Let me tell you. Picture this. You're a mom. You wake up. You want to have your morning coffee before anybody talks to you. <laughs> While the, the kids are asleep, everything is silent, and you just want to relax on the couch with your cup of coffee. But let's get real, that never happens, <laughs> especially for nurse moms because we are constantly on the go. So I don't know about you guys, but I have a little baby. She is, um, oh my gosh, she's 11 months old now. I was about to say 10 months, but she's actually 11 months old now. And she has very variegated sleep patterns. So sometimes she sleeps in till, you know, seven, eight o'clock. Sometimes she's up at five, six o'clock. I never know. So picture this. You're sitting on the couch and you're trying to drink your cup of coffee, but you keep getting interrupted by this or that. One child walks in, 
mom, I'm so hungry. Can we have some breakfast? Another child walks in. Oh, mom, I've got to go to basketball practice. Can we uh, go get something to eat before we go? Or can we stop at the gas station before we go so I can get a drink? And then the baby is like, you know, over there picking something off the floor, trying to put it in her mouth. Anyway, my point is you are up and down like 50 million times and I reheat my coffee at least five times, like literally every morning. Let me know in the comments below, moms, how many times in the mornings do you have to reheat your cup of coffee to be able to drink hot coffee? This drives me absolutely nuts. Like I just wanna have one cup of hot coffee, like all the way through the cup. I would just like to be able to sit there and drink it hot. But since that is not realistic, this little guy right here is going to help me achieve that. I am going to be able to have a full hot cup of coffee and here's why. This little coffee cup comes with this little disc right here. This comes also with a cord that you plug in, sort of like you would your cell phone, and this heats up your coffee cup. It keeps the contents inside your cup at a constant 130 degrees. Isn't that amazing? 130 degrees every time you pick it up. And it works through induction heating, which is so neat because it makes the, the cup not really hot and the disc not really hot, but the contents inside are 133 degrees. So, oh my gosh, the baby's over there in the floor eating something, not a big deal. Setting my cup on the little disc, going to get the baby to keep her from choking on whatever it is she's found in the floor now. I come back, sit down, pick up my cup of coffee. <sighs> yes, yes, my coffee is so hot. Sounds like a dream, doesn't it? But guess what? It gets better. Yes, it gets better. This little disc is not only to keep your coffee warm, but it also charges your phone. I know, right? So this is like the perfect thing to keep plugged in at your end table, at your couch, because while you're not using it for your coffee, you can just put your phone on it and it charges it. Now, I will say there is one setback for me. Because I use these cute little loopy cases, I have to take my case off of my phone to charge it on this disc because it has to be laid flat on its back. It cannot be laid face down. It will not charge like that. And in fact, the directions say, do not lay your phone face down. It has to be face up like this. This little loop thing keeps my phone from laying flat on its back. So I am unable to charge my phone with my case on. But if I take my case off, set it on the disc, it charges it and it is fantastic. Also for an added bonus, I know like it could get any better, it does. It comes with a little lid to keep any debris out of your cup, especially if you are drinking your cup maybe outside on the back porch. It keeps little particles from getting into your cup. This was my absolute favorite gift that I found. I don't know why this excites me so much. I love coffee, what can I say? Also, um, reading the back of the box here, I just want to let you know that this is dishwasher safe, so but you cannot, absolutely cannot put it in the microwave because it has um, the metal at the bottom that helps it to work with the induction heating. So, favorite one. The next gift that I have in my basket are these adorable little foot warming socks. I found these at Walmart and I think these are so comfortable. I love fuzzy socks. My feet are always so cold and on my days off, I just wanna snuggle on the couch and all of the warmth of the blankets and my fuzzy socks and my coffee. And these just give me all of the things. Absolutely love these. These are super inexpensive, maybe three to five bucks at Walmart. Love these. Keeping with the comfort theme, the next thing that I have in my basket is this cute Barefoot Dreams cardigan. I absolutely love this cardigan and it's very fuzzy. Let me see if you can pick up the texture on camera. It's very fuzzy, very soft. 
If you have ever heard of the Barefoot Dreams Company and tried them, you will no doubt already love them. They are amazing. I find them at Nordstrom. They make different pajamas, they make cardigans, they make socks, they make blankets. You've probably seen the, the leopard print blanket like all over the internet during the Nordstrom anniversary sale and still um, it sells out like literally every time it goes into stock. But this is like my absolute favorite cardigan. I wear it all the time. I am constantly wearing it to work like over my scrubs and even just here around the house when I want to lounge around. It is so comfortable. The next thing that I have on my list is a nursing journal. I am in love with these cute little nursing journals from a company called Nurses Inspire Nurses. I know like, I know a journal is maybe a strange thing to say that, um, you know, you should get someone for Christmas, but I feel like, and this is my opinion, every nurse should keep a work journal. Because as a nurse, in our profession, we are at very high risk for litigation. I write down like literally everything in my nursing journal because you know like they say in nursing school if it isn't documented it doesn't happen this is just a way for us to protect ourselves to document things that happen day to day um, document maybe something that you're feeling something that happened at work that you may think someone might have a question on later on down the road these little nursing journals are the cutest I love this company so much because of the message that they have they are all about helping other nurses giving each other support nurses inspiring nurses um, they have all kinds of online classes about coping with stress and how to cope with different things at work and finding work home life balance and I just love them so much. I am definitely going to be linking their website below um, so that you can check them out and see if there are any resources besides just the nursing journals on their website that might help you out too because that's what this channel is all about also. Nurse moms helping nurse moms, supporting each other, building each other up with positivity. And I absolutely love that so much. The last thing that I have here in my basket is this Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Lip Secret Set. Now, nurses, we don't have time to put on a lot of makeup, especially at work. We're gonna be sweating that off. We're gonna be running around like crazy. So we're not really too concerned about what we look like. And especially now with all of the gear that we have to wear. I mean, we have, gowns, we have face masks, then we have N95s on top of that, and then we have face shields on top of that, and hair nets and shoe covers, and you name it. But you know what? Not every day do we want to walk around looking like a zombie. I mean, it's okay to slap on a little lip gloss here and there and put on a little mascara here and there. We don't want to take off all of our gear at the end of the day and feel tired and exhausted and worn out, plus, um, you know, looking like a zombie like we don't want to look in the mirror at the end of the day and be like whoa is that is that me oh my god i gotta go home <laughs> so there are a few little things that i like to do for myself just to make myself feel a little bit better a little bit more put together and this little charlotte tilbury lip set is one of my absolute favorites one of the things that makes the pillow talk lip set iconic from charlotte tilbury is it literally goes with any skin tone because buying other people makeup is really risky because makeup and skincare to me is something that is super personal i would not want other people like picking out my makeup or my skincare like ever because I'm very, very picky about it. But this is one exception. This pillow talk color that Charlotte Tilbury has in not only the lip sets, but a lot of other little beauty products that she has out really like it literally suits everybody's skin tone. You could probably never buy this for a girl and her be like, I'm not wearing that. I promise you, she will love it. <laughs> All right, well that wraps up this video. That is all that I have for you in my little basket of gifts here. If you guys have any other ideas on what to get the nurse in your life for Christmas, 
let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today in my living room and talking about Christmas gifts. I am so thankful for your support on this channel. And as always, if you would like to be a part of this community of other nurse moms who are lifting each other up with positivity and here to help each other find that balance in our lives that we all crave, hit that subscribe button down below. Thank you again so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye. I did my love.